Thank you, Marissa. We are continuing to follow the alarming incident at Peace Health University District Hospital in Eugene, where a man made threats to hospital staff early this afternoon. Hospital officials have restricted access, and we have just learned those restrictions will stay in place at least through the night. KZI 9 News reporter Jessica Babb is live there with what we know about the suspect so far. Matt, Renee, we know that the man who allegedly made these threats was a patient here and that he was 37 years old. And I just got off the phone with Eugene police just 15 minutes ago. And they've also just told us he's about six foot two and about 200 pounds and was last seen wearing dark clothing running down Alder Street, which is just about a block away, running toward West 11th. Now, police tell us they know who they're looking for. They just haven't given us his name just yet. And police also say he told hospital staff he would come back after allegedly threatening them early today around 10 30. The hospital is still restricting patient access entry at the emergency room plus part of the clinic that connects to the hospital and like we mentioned those restrictions are expected to stay in place throughout the night and luckily police say no weapons were observed today but that wasn't the case back in March when several Peace Health hospitals including this one downtown were placed under security restrictions after two gun related incidents at Riverbend where one patient took their own life and a man brought a rifle to the hospital and tonight, multiple agencies are still investigating these alleged threats at the University District Hospital. So as the story develops, we will continue to bring you the latest. Reporting live in Eugene, Jessica Babb, KZI 9 News.